Alright guys, here are the ceiling fans in my condo running on all their speeds. Um, there are only two fans here. We have these, um, Hampton, this one here is a Hampton Bay Gazebo 2. And the other one here is also a Hampton Bay Gazebo 2. But it's running on reverse. That's sad. Maybe the people didn't realize that it was running on reverse. So that thing needs to be reversed. Let's turn the light on, both of them. It's not as bright as yesterday when I first arrived, and it's not as hot. And the capacitors messed up on this one, too. Probably from the beach and all this stuff, like, you know, these things get oxidized a lot. No, very, they get very rusted, you know, this time of year. And look at how close it is to hitting the ceiling. I mean, the wall. And yes, I'm sorry about all the wind chime noise, yes. I can't change that. It's like all the way over in that fitness center. Or somewhere else, I don't even know. This is uh, an Airbnb, uh, so I don't know if I'm allowed to tell you what where the place is or not. I've always told it in my uh, previous video, so this is another Palm Ruba Condos. All right, let's go to medium. I think that light kit's almost falling off. Yeah, and this is where it starts to hum. This one isn't even humming. Makes me r really appreciate that there's one fan that's running well. After like five years of this place being here. And 
like the condition of the pool honestly got worse. Over there, the lights falling out. Uh, there's not much problems here, just some tiles falling off. On here, there's some tiles falling off as well. There, more tiles falling off. Like, just in, on the entire perimeter, there's like, there's a bunch of tiles that are falling off. And yeah, they do need to be caulked. They do need to be caulked up. Oh yeah, also, I know I just noticed one of the blades are angled, strangely. And there, this one is, uh, of course, running on reverse. So I can't change that. Changing my hearing aids up a bit so they're not as annoying. And we rented a Kia Picanto. <coughs> I don't know how you say. <laughs> My left hand is getting tired. Low and high are honestly just the same. Oh, now it's just a stupid your phone is getting hot thing. The quality is already crap anyway. Like, this phone is standing underneath a fan. How can it, how can it get hot? I'm taking the phone out of this case. Oh no, and I took the hard shell off as well. Oh, come on. Um, I don't know which hand I was filming with. No, it was this way. Um, I'm, I'm doing this just so that the phone can get a little less hot. Well, I'm not going to turn that light on. Turn the light on anyway. Well, there it is running on high. But let's switch this thing up to high. It's very buzzy, annoying Hampton Bay. Look at that. The hum got louder. Oh, now you basically can't even hear it. Yeah, you can even... Like, it's not even moving that fast or moving any air. Because the owner decided, well, well, people are, well, people are in, uh, in, in Cary, where I live. And it's, it's the winter, so why not switch this fan to reverse? What a good idea. So deep. And there it is running on high. It does wobble. If you turn on the 
the light and, and you get up here. I don't know if you can tell, but it is wobbling. Provides lots of wind. For a Hampton Bay, that's real nice. Here's your um, chain extensions. Obviously, this was bought at Home Depot. This also at Home Depot was what? And you can even spin this little fan. Of course, it's going to be hard. There it is running on high. It's kind of noisy, but it does a, it does a good job of moving air. Especially in these days. Yesterday when it was super hot. I wasn't really even out here, but I was running this thing anyway. And if you can see my hand, it's kind of moving a little. Yeah, that's what make that's what's making these trains move a lot. Anyway, let's check up on this buzzy thing. Yeah, it's not moving very fast at all. It obviously has capacitor issues. But on. Oh, it literally looks like there's a light in there. Guess that's the whole point of this thing. This is a 52 inch if I know well. Turn this thing off. Show them with the light. Let me see if I was running it on the correct speed. Also, that's what it looks like starting up. Man, it seems getting hot. Really, it is. I think it's probably just because of the case and I didn't feel it. But there, there's this one. And there's this one. I can even feel, I can even feel the air up to here. That's, that's kind of good. I mean, and it's honestly a lot better than BLDC fans that like go so slow, but they don't even move any air. Here it is with, here's this other gazebo on high with the fan. I mean, with with the light. Here it is off. Now let's watch these things spin down, shall we? I think I should do a redo. Oh well, I don't care. 
We're just gonna watch this one spin down. And that one is still going fast, even though it went real slow. Hold on. I want to do something here. Have a bit of fun with the fan. Let's watch them start with the light. From zero to high. Yes, I know. This door is unlocked. This door is unlocked, but it was supposed to carry me away. My parents let me in there, so. Let's start them up like, uh, Like uh, the Hunter in Casablanca fanatic. There we go. Now both of the fans are just getting their little opportunity to spin down. And that AC is off, but I'm still getting a bit of AC from here. And because obviously I'm not fat, and I'm doing this from the switch that it's operating on. Because obviously I can't do from zero to high and get back fast enough to um, get the view of the camera well. Also, this kind of looks like a Home Decorator's Collection Marshlands. Except, it doesn't have those lines going through it, and it's not available in this color. For most of what I've seen. Look at those beautiful palms. And this thing just goes right with the place, I mean, it just looks good. Also, I have some, like, random cut on my hand. I don't know where I got that from at all. Uh, let's wait for this one to spin down. You get the last moments of it swinging down. And here you can kind of see where the wobble issue is. Yeah, you can see some of the blades are all drippy, but this is what it was made for. Also, the fan is still spinning at the same speed. Sure, these are very nice fans, but really, um, they're just, the blades aren't the proper material. Alright, let's do this. Again, it's like this Levi tin thing. And there's paint under it. 
Well, let's want to turn on. Zero to high with the light. Is that squeaking? No, that's all the corn being added. And here we go, we're going to turn this one on. I know that this could be 21 minutes long with this uh, whole style with the light thing. Watch this thing spin down from inside because it's kind of hot. Shut this door first. Let's watch the one that's properly working spin down. And I'm doing this from inside because, gosh, I can't. I mean, it's kind of hot outside, and the air conditioning here is nice and cold. I think I'm going to get the air conditioner and here start it up. This is taking a really long time to uh, spin down. That one is the most, that one's the trippiest. You can see that it's just hanging down lower than the other blades are. That's going to be it because this thing's going to take too long to spin down. And after two whole minutes, setting the AC up and the one from my room, this happened. Yay, it turned off. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.